Welcome back, folks. Sooner Pro Gaming here, sharing more pro player tips and strategies for FS19. Y'all feeling good? Get this video a quick thumbs up if you feel it mighty fine. Play that like button, folks. It will be surely appreciated. Here we go. Kicking up some dirt. This is the first game I started back when FS19 was first released back in mid-November, almost two years ago. I hear you, man. Listen to that motor roar. It sound, it sound like it's saying, welcome back, boss. Had a park down here where we sell straw and buy animals. Take a look at some of our settings. When we, when we first started, we had the settings on easy to increase the prices down here in SDN Shalapacha. They have good prices. Good farming overall, and these parts, if you adapt well with the style and the surroundings, some of our numbers where we left off. Man, I had to go through sweat and grind to get this game file back up and running. I had to re-download FS19. Somehow the memory on my PS4 got all screwed up. So after getting the game downloaded, I had to re-download the map and other equipment. And here we go. Successfully returning to SEN to La Pacho. I hope, I hope I'm saying it correctly. And as you can see, we still have over 40 million plus earnings we racked up. We was on the heavy ground, folks, getting it in. As you can see, we pulled off into our first FS19 farm ever. South American vibe. Good fertile land. That's the great key to farming, folks. That's some brain food. In this video, we will spend some QT, some quality time, getting things back in order down here in EL, La Pacho. For the new adventures we will be doing to earn more cash for the farm operation. This will be a good series to share some very helpful advice and strategies to use when dealing with big large amounts of cash to invest. We will show how we managed to accumulate 40 million plus all from the mind and good back muscle, no cheat codes, just equipment and game mods, and dedication, smart work, and reputation. Had to retreat a favorite 515C. I see the Brahmins are still doing well, looking fit and healthy giving them some Sooner Pro top-notch nutritional diet. You know what I'm saying? The total mixed ration, give them a little hay. And they survive on that good pasture forage. Go over here and jump off to the man, TGS 18.500 4 by 4 I'm glad to return and find everything not too out of place. I'm refreshing my memory as we go trying to figure out what we were doing the last time that we was back on the farm. So as we, as we go through, get things situated and organized, things will slowly but surely come back to, to what we was doing. Over here on field six, I think, I'm not too sure what, who was working this field, but it, it, it has canola on it, as you can see. The big New Holland over there. Take a look at our finances. We was doing a little bit of investing. On Wednesday, we, we had a nice, nice day for 2.4 million. Today, 
We got close to half a million. Getting property income. We got our we got our biogas plant down there bringing in some income. So we got a few income streams going, and we're gonna get into that on a later video. But for now, we just gonna get these, you know, bring our vehicles back to the main farm. Make sure we tally up and see which fields still need to be harvested, which fields are already been harvested. As you can see, we got cotton growing down on the southern part of the map. We got some fields ready to be harvested just about, and then some will be harvested in the next trimester phase. So I'm seeing that we only did, we, we got semis, so we was doing some heavy, you know, we was, we was trying to do some heavy numbers. We wasn't really trying to do no small tippers, trailers, we going straight big. Large loads, man, equal large gains. How about finish John Deere 790 S? Get these seeds off the field real quick. We got sunflower seeds going on th on field 13. We could we could have acquired all the all the maps. You know, I mean, excuse my French. All the all the fields on the map. But we, but some of we did, we really, we just gonna kind of, you know, try to stay within our means, you know. Sometimes the location really wasn't as good for the traveling and this and so. I think we'll be more efficient just to work what we got. We gonna keep, we ain't gonna work. We just gonna keep that cotton down on the southern end going. Buy a couple things that's new. New off in the game like the animal broom that's gonna come in handy. I was using the Kramer with a with a shovel on the front to clean up the clean around their pins. One of the fave, the M NMC the Skyrock 4x4. We finna transform him. We gonna keep him with that angel white. That's a mighty truck right there, fam. Slick got the lift kit with the chromies on him. We just gonna lease him. Not a good finance move to spend 70k at the time. Hop off in the lizard hulk. I like this big old truck. He can pull some weight, boy. We finna take him to the filler station. Fill him up, but we gonna go. We gonna go do a little side thing. We gonna go down south and move to the module cotton picker. This cotton picker here, guys, call him CPG. He can earn his key. If he needs help, we'll lease a buddy to help him work picking these fields down here on the southern end of the map. As you can see, we have transformed this soccer field into a hub. And take the green man's back down there. Yeah, we didn't transfer him to soccer field into the hub, man. We're on the south end. We in the big loop, baby. Sooner pro style. As you can see, the big case that filled up, finished up field six. The rest of the canola off his back. Look through our vehicles. We own everything, no leases until now. The Skyrock 4x4, we just leased it. We need some new tractors, and our plan is to lease all our equipment. Until we see that we need to purchase something. I believe we're looking to expand and acquire another livestock to generate more income to our farm. We have a goal to make 10 million. 
I'm not sure how long it will take. But it's our short term goal. Short term goal. If you guys, guys would like to share how you came in contact with our channel, that would be very appreciated. And you guys are awesome. Make sure you subscribe and ring that bell. Please and thank you. Moving along with getting things in order. Over here, we have some Brahmas. We got the light brown Brahmas. And in the other pen, we had an offspring to the brown Brahmas and the light brown Brahmas. Our two cow herds. So when the pens fill up, we transport the, the, the offspring to that pen over there that you just seen with the mixture of the two herds, cows, the light brown and the brown Brahmas. And that brings additional manure and slurry to make profits from our biogas plant. As you can see, everything kind of running along in sync. We're going to go over here and make sure all our solar panel, our solar energy, our green works is, is in order. You know, make sure everything is going on. You know, everything is intact. Ain't no wires loose. Or, you know, not, nothing that's going to stop our income from flowing. This, this, this section right here helps us cut costs and brings in profits through our green energy solar panels all around our farm. Let's go over here to the seed field. Field 13. How about for the Deer 790S? Wrap this field up. Getting a nice yield here. Our seeds are looking great. Deer is running great. Doesn't need to tune up. Go over here and drop our canola off. Get it off the field. Say what up to the light brown Brahmas right there. Our cows have been bringing earnings in from milk. Manure and slurry in uh, Austria. We at it again, guys.
pulling in, we in the slick four by four. Look at Mighty Fine. We was having a little trouble back there with our broomsticks, man. Trying to keep them on board. This is a new mod in the game. We finna test it out. See how does it work. Get our animals cleaned up. Pimp them up a little bit. Give them some, some quality time, especially our calves over here. They ain't too messy. Brooms are working mighty fine. You can run with them. Oh, yeah. You ain't got to get in a tractor. You ain't got to, you know, do too much to clean up around that space. Brooms, man. 100% thumbs up to these people who made these brooms. Good job, guys. Got our Brahmins all cleaned up. That one was that was an animal broom. This is a I guess the broom to clean up around the, around your farm. We gonna test it out and see can it clean up animals, clean up out the animals as well. I believe this was an animal pen over. I'm not sure. Cause when everything messed up, a lot of stuff just went away and disappeared, or I'm not sure what happened. So we just gonna clean up around this area. We gonna put, we gonna use the space for something. Like they say, space earns income. Run down here. This was our first. This was our first herd of brown brahmins. These cows have earned millions of dollars over the past that we've been since we've been started since we started this. When I first got the FS19 game, I was on this game day and night. is cleaning up out the animals as well so I guess it's an all around you can use them for both it's all good okay now let's take the lizard back I see he didn't get nothing to fill it up oh well Go over here and get him sprayed off. Put him under the, put him under some cover. I believe we're gonna have to get, get us an auto, get us some auto loader trailers for our silage bills over there. We're gonna have to turn that into some cash. We were making money off silage bills as well. Nice brown tractor. I like that brown color. Over at Field 13, finna help out the John Deere S790. Oh, my bad, sir. Help him out real quick. Unload, unload up. As you can see, we got forty million three hundred and sixty thousand and two hundred seventy-nine dollars. Our mission is to get fifty million ASAP. Oh, I love riding in this truck right here, man. Sweet feeling off on that red dirt. Got a nice old pad right there with the swimming pool. You know, we go after hard, long days of work, man. We go out there, get our swim on. Atmosphere. 
lovely. See, we got some solar, solar panels over there, man. We generate income, passive income. We got it all type of ways. Give it up for the new Holland CR10.90. Gonna crank him up. Peel off over here. Gonna go over here and help out the deer. Gonna assist the deer. Gonna put on our header. Gonna put on the corn header and the, and the sunflower seed header. Go we'll chop this field up real quick. Get it out the way. As you can see. As we've been organizing different things, we've been slowly but surely harvesting our fields, you know, taking care of different things. We still got it in motion. Our workers is helping us out, man. Shout out to the workers. See how I matched that blue head up with that new Holland Blue, man? You know, we kind of swaggy over here, Sooner Pro Gaming. Chop him up. Got them good old seeds. Finna get ready to get the market. That's our Kramer. That's what we used to clean our animal pens with. Now we finna just put him over here. We might not need him no more. But we don't know. I'm, I don't know. I'm just gonna take him over here and get him out of the way. We don't, I had a shed over here. Some type of. I think it was like a three door mechanical door shed. I don't know where it went. We just gonna back the Kramer up over there. Got our cow. That's what we was transporting our offspring with from, from here to there. Check out our old garage. We need to get a, get us a nice old car to put up in there. If you got any ideas, folks, let me know what kind of, you know, if we should get the Mustang or get a flatbed. You know, we got to get something nice, you know, luxury. We, we worth 40 million, so we gotta live up to our, you know, live up to our dream, you know. Got a nice hundred million, you know, plus house right here. <laughs> what more can a man ask for? Got the fam, you know, living a dream. Got a nice plane hangover over there, man. They doing all right. Get us a lap in one time. Cool us, cool us off. Got the grill going. Well, we got the grill. We ain't got it going. You know, I, that's what I. What I think I. When I think I first made, made the, we made the first man. I put that sand castle up right there. So it's. So we forty levels up. I say, we gonna add. We gonna add another love. They might got some mods, you know, some little, some little stuff to add, you know, decoration. When we get 50 million, we're going to put a decoration up. And we're going to, you know, we're going to make as a representation of one of our Patreons. That's how we're going to do it. we got a Patreon. Shout out to my Patreon, Sooner Pro Gaming. Much love. We appreciate you. Thumbs up. You will be blessed. Yeah, I think we did have a cow patch because that's that's the manure. We got our uh, converter belts over there. I'm using these converter belts that come in handy. You know, we ain't got to do too much. Just pull right up under the converter belt. Pop it out. Go turn on our. Turn, turn this lower brown belt on. We can never get it to come on. Get that old manure. We're gonna try to see if we can increase profits down here in this biogas plant. Let 
Hopefully we can get us a full load. Then you know where we headed. To the biogas plant, folks. We get money off the biofuel. Love the John Deere XUV. Look, Gator. Back you mode. We finna take this over here by this. Where it was originally... We just gonna take it over here to this, cause this one ain't got one. Get our header out the way. Getting this space ready for our next adventure. Drop this header off right here. 31, 62, Draper. Big boy. Keep slamming the gator right here. Oh, they didn't matter. See, see how fast they knocked this field off once that team where we just gonna back the gator around let the new holler should clip him off. Field complete 13. Field 13 is complete. We got a nice little yield of seeds. We're gonna add this to our to our numbers. And eventually, we're gonna sell all the crops there. I think we got some crops in the silo still. We're gonna sell all that off. See how much we can see. I'm pretty sure we got a million or two. You know, I'm not, I'm not for sure, but there go them pretty old sunflower seeds. Make sure you Hit that subscribe button. Make sure you hit that line if you want some of these good old sunflower seeds. Top quality, A grade. Yeah, I heard this good old South American fertile soil. And that brings us back to you guys out there farming. You have to make sure your soil has the right nutrients, make sure, make sure your pH pH levels and everything is good, you know, make sure you got good, see this look like it got a lot of, you know, clay, you know, mixture of clay in it, so it, you know, holds water, mixed with, you know, some silt, so we got good fertile, the roots can penetrate. Down, down and off in there so we can get to the ground water, pull that water down from the ground up into the plant so you can have good healthy plants, good farm stems. Park all deer up here. Yeah, we got us a full load. 48,000 liters of manure. This might fetch a pretty penny. Pulling into the biogas plant. See, we got our slurry, slurry tanker. Forty-eight thousand. We get paid at midnight for my, for my whatever we get out of the bio gas plant. Spray them all. 
gonna take this rig back to the farm. Just picking up after ourselves a little bit. Like my mom always told me, pick up after yourself, son. I learned that women are very good at organizing things. Like if, like I'm pretty sure you know when you go to some of some of these ladies' houses, the inside be so amazing. You know, and, and majority of them all got different creativity, different you know styles of furniture, etc. You know, and that stuck with me. Keeping your things organized and neat, so you know where things are when you need them. It's a special feeling, and you will be rewarded for organizing and keeping up in anything you guys do. So always remember that. Organization and neat and tidiness gets you a long way. And another thing, I would like to share my content with you guys. We have about 30 plus videos on our playlist and we're in the making of making many more. So if you guys will go check out our SPG playlist, our Pseudo Pro Gaming playlist, we have a few games that we're playing you know, we're showing people how to play these games great with tips and tricks and strategies. And we also showing you guys how you can turn these different strategy things into everyday livelihood. You can use these things in everyday situations, life situations, in anything. And if you, you really, really focus and use them, it'll bring prosperity to your life. Not just financially, overall as a, as a person, you know, with confidence with the wisdom, with the knowledge, with the physicality of everything with your mind and your heart. And then on top of that, you're going to learn how to be an awesome gamer. Or you can learn awesome strategies, tips, tactics from gamers in your everyday livelihood. Sort of pro gaming, you bring an awesome content to the platform. So make sure you guys tune in, stick with us, show us some support and subscribe to our channel. Follow us on our other social media platforms. We're on Twitter, we're on Facebook, and we got our Instagram. We're currently working on it to bring it up to par. And we have more to come on this great channel over here at Sooner Pro Gaming. We are gamers, baby. So tune in and put your thinking caps on and let's get it going. Let's go, guys. Moving through our farm, we in our green little fence, our fence. We just still moving things around, putting it back. Basically, we just getting all the things off, putting them under the shed, getting them cleaned up. We got our weedy, weeder right here. But we probably ain't gonna be able to use these no more because we just came into some different type of methods where we really ain't gotta worry about weeds no more. Little, little might pop up, but it's probably about 99% chance that we ain't gonna see too many weeds with this thing that we use them with our seeds, some of our seeds. I believe this is the only track that we have at the moment. And it's getting ready to show you that we really, 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 really need some high-powered tractors, guys. I got a couple of them in mind what we're going to use, but we're always looking for people to bring some advice. You can put type of tractors you like, the type of tractors you may think will work good with these type of setups. But we're really focused on right now is getting our fields taken care of to get some more seed in the ground and get us some crops generating so we can bring in some more income off harvesting. We was using this to pick up straw and hay when we use it for our animals. We were storing it over there in the hay loft. to make total mixed ration and also just filling them up. But at the moment right now, we got this new equipment. It's called the multi-filling station. 
and these guys have allowed us to experiment with this thing so now we're gonna be we already ordered it but they gotta bring it to the farm so we're gonna be using a tactic that can increase efficiency and overall performance with our cattle with our livestock things like that So as you can see, we got a nice little penny. We're finna get over 100,000. So that was a nice thing just sitting around, you know what I'm saying? So you guys can look like you might have things just sitting around that you're really not using or need. And you know, it's been, you know, you didn't kind of paid off. You didn't got, got your, got, got, got his, you know, it didn't pay, pay this dues. And you can let it go. Get some cash back in your account. And if we ever need it again, we just use some of that cash to lease it to make more money so all in all it seems like we can put up more cash and work and work with our equipment and make our checkbook balance out and earn some profit. got another animal trailer I was looking through the magazine they got another animal trailer and it, it can hold many more cows and sheep and pigs so a push come to shove I'm not sure we might have to sell sell that trailer and get some money back so we had a good start I can get ready to wrap things up for the day. But when we come back with another video, we will be starting off where we left off on this video. And things are going to be getting more interesting. So stay close. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Click the bell. Get future updates on my videos. And you can see when I drop this next video down here at Esciancha La Pocho. Sooner Pro Gaming, once again, bringing another farm sim video to the platform. Thank you guys for tuning in. It's not a game, it's a red stick.